Okay, Hydroflex 60 installed in my house. Uh, burning fine. Just want to show how we plumbed it up to uh, a buffer tank and the uh, basic controls. Um, I have my feet adjustment turned all the way up to number six. I am going for a high temp of 165 and a low temp of 150. I have a really good fire going in there. Everything pretty much gets burnt up before it tips over the end. That's why I'm able to have my feed rate turned up so well. Uh, the unit is smart enough to actually modulate itself to uh, allow for the demand on the house. So over here I have my supply coming out the top here. Then going down we have a, a ball valve that goes into my return that I can adjust that ball valve based on the temperature. On the other side going into my return I have a temperature gauge so I can see what my return water is because I like to keep that up around my 140 which it is um, anyway then we go from our feed over down into the bottom of my 60 gallon hot water tank then we also have a return for my dumb zone, which I have upstairs, which is a cast iron radiator. Um, return with my uh, expansion tank. I had a Kerr TW2000 in here but first because that explains all the mess of copper and stuff we had to adjust, but there's my return. And put a well in there just in case I wanted to have another temperature gauge in there. I put one right into the tank. It was an old one that I had from a solar tank. Um, just stuck it in there in the top element. Um, anyway, so then here it goes our return. Return goes down into a circulating pump, which I just have plugged into a wall receptacle. Um, we could plug it into the front here into your dump zone but basically all that does is it constantly circulates the water between the Hydroflex 60 and the 60 gallon hot water tank so that allows me to use the aquastat that's in the Harman Hydroflex to maintain the temperature in the in the in the buffer tank uh, generally I have about you know, five, six, seven, eight degrees in the difference between my tank to my Aquastat. So I have it turned up to 165 so I can store about 160, 150 degree water in there. So it works really good. Um, each one of my zones uh, has its own circulating pump. I have a grand total of uh, four zones. Um, there's uh, pipes to go my heated slab and then I have a uh, Taco uh, um, control on the wall, and it just shows that my two up upstairs zones are are um, calling for heat right now. So um, anyway, yeah, that's what we have done, uh, and it works great. I burn approximately 1.33 bags a day in the Hydroflex, so I'm extremely happy with it.